How is everybody doing? Today we have the special release of the Pokemon Ultra. Uh, <laughs> my bad, the Pokemon Ultra Beasts. All right. So let's get right into this review. I'm real. I already watched it, so I'm just gonna go over the trailer and stuff. So this Pokemon looks hella cool. He looks like some kind of ancient kind of thing. It has some like Vaporeon tails, some dragon claws. It has that axe on his head. It's called type normal. It's the normal type, and it has that uh, elemental uh, kind of move set to it. And this Pokemon is a pure dragon type with a heart on his head. I'm thinking that his type is gonna change as it goes on. The ability is bulletproof or soundproof either way. And uh, I think it's gonna be great. The Raticate right now. Look at this Raticate. It's hella cool. It's like black. The bottom is like kind of gray. And this thing is gonna be like the boss leader of the um, Raditus that we saw back in the other review. All right. Uh, Hyper Fane is gonna be extra powerful now. And we found out that so Pokemon Sun and Moon are different because of the 12-hour base time. It's always night in Pokemon Sun. Po always day in Pokemon Sun. Uh, my bad. Opposite, um, and different totem Pokemons. The Raticate as the totem of the Pokemon Sun, and the um, watch thing kind of thing, uh, uh, and the other um, foundation, which is the secondary um, source for your help. I'm guessing there will be side quests in this thing. So uh, side quests is that's like you're gonna help them um, defeat Team Skull, and in some way you gotta follow a certain path. Wiki, uh, I think she's gonna play a big role in this helping of uh, my theory. And they want to sell Pokemon, so um, they make money off selling Pokemons. Gladion, this dude is like the Yeri Oak of the of the oh uh, man of this game. You know, Gary Oak, you always have that rival, but this time he's gonna be the Team Skull. And don't forget that you're getting Zygarde cells. You collect them. I'm guessing you're gonna build up a Zygarde. And possibly be catching it. You store them in those little cases. Alright, Pokemon Snap is here right now. Oh man. Get perfect snaps. And you can find it. Um, you can actually go share, uh, share all the, these the snaps. Oh man, it looks super cool. Pokemon Snap for you guys. And now the Ultra Threat, the Ultra Beast. This things I said uh, looks like a freaking jellyfish, alright? Uh, tell me if you guys agree. Pokemon Sun and Moon, like it always says, um, it's going to be out on November. Alright guys, since we have three minutes, uh, I'm looking forward to, um, to be talking about going again, um, th this trailer and just like, giving my opinions this time. Alright, Type Null. This thing looks super cool. It looks super ancient. Uh, I'm really liking the Vaporeon tail. I think it's uh, something that would be like something good for PvP and all. Something introduced. But it wouldn't be like strong as the Pseudo Legends. That's what I think. And uh, Type Null, I I'm pretty sure uh, that's not a normal Pokemon name. So I think it's going to have an evolution. So as something like type something else, like type ghost, because I can see some kind of ghost figure in there. Um, I think it would be creepy if this was actually like a dead Vaporeon, my theory. But um, so you know, yeah, I'm really enjoying this um, Pokemon. Uh, review and I'm pretty sure you guys are too and I want you guys to have fun stuff so the Pokemon Ultra uh, be Ultra Beast legendary Pokemon that thing looks like a jellyfish jellyfish and not sh I'm not sure if you guys really like it. it it doesn't look like any other kind of um legendaries you will see like strongs all right, bye guys. I hope you guys enjoyed this review. I'm really liking these Pokemon. Very awesome. Let's go. Team Fat Pikachu. That's what I'm going to call my squad now. All right, love you guys so much. Love you guys so much. And we're going to do a meetup. Love you guys. Bye. Love